Thank you, Sam. Oh. <laughs> I'm allergic to lipstick. <laughs> What's up, Mobile High Squad? Here in Baguio City, Philippines, with my mom. Hello. The Golden Girls, Tita from Winnipeg, Tita from Chicago, my Tita Tonya, and Ate Elsie, and the crew. We're the Baguio crew. Raquel, Jaya, Israel, Kuya Ryan, the best driver in the world, and Edmark, Mr. Suave. Look at this Filipino food. Mmm. Filipino food, goodness. That's Sinigang. Is it better than your homemade sinigang? Yeah. Yeah. You're being humble. You've been eating my cooking board. Let's taste. Let's see. Is this sinigang better than my mom's? <laughs> no, yours is better. Yeah. Thank you, Sam. <laughs> oh. I'm allergic to lipstick. <laughs> but this is really tasty. Guys, check this out. Laing and liempo. So laing is like cooked gabi leaves with coconut cream, I think. See? The, the lechon has a song for the laing. What's the song? Huh? What song? Laing bisani. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> That's a Bustos. Bustos joke of the day. <laughs> Daddy, he's your replacement. Right now. <laughs> All right. Look at this. Mmm, yambo. Pork. They make good pork here in the Philippines. Mm hmm. I know you guys know lechon. Let's eat this. Not no. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Whoa. Spicy. Mmm. Mm. Mm -mm. The crunch of the skin do Wow. Mm -mm -mm. Tortan talong. Oh, you used to make this. Yeah, I always And this is. Kare kare. Kare kare. Peanut based sauce. Oh. Filipino food. Seriously. Here at the Palenque, look at all this fresh produce, strawberries, celery, lettuce. Mm. Because of the climate here in Baguio, they grow some really amazing fresh veggies and fruits. Ah, and you got walis up there, Filipino brooms. <laughs> yes. So guys, I am going through the Ant Canada comments and wow, I just got to say, AC family who are watching these vlogs, you guys are amazing. I cannot believe how many people are enthusiastic and eager about these ant videos. I don't feel like such a nerd anymore. <laughs> or I do feel like a nerd, but it's assuring to me that you guys are also nerds. And it does seem that a lot of you guys <laughs> are asking for two videos a week on the Ants Canada channel. So if I was just an Ants Canada YouTuber, like I didn't do my other channels. I could definitely do that. I would dedicate my whole life and time to uploading two videos, maybe even three Ant videos a week. And that's what most YouTubers do. They focus on one channel and it grows and explodes, you know, into the millions and really is successful. Now that would also make the most business sense because I could earn more from the Ants Canada channel if I double the output um, and it would earn double the subscribers, right, a week. But that would mean I would have to give up the Filipino comedy channel and give up this vlogging channel because I wouldn't be able to travel as much. Um, like, I mean, for touring and for work and all of that. It's my dilemma now. And I'm not going to talk about how much money I make on any of my channels, but if I increased the output to by two, we're talking a lot of money. <laughs> but then again, you know, it comes down to being happy, being passionate about life. Would uploading two ant videos a week, all the hours, like every video takes 20 hours to do, would I be completely happy giving up my entertainment career? Would I be completely happy having to sacrifice and give up travel and touring? Right? 
writing parodies, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I would be happy. AC family happy, that's for sure. I wish there were like five of me. I could clone myself times five. Another thing that I realized is that when I'm old, which by the way, I don't believe in. <laughs> I don't believe in getting old. I feel like I w if I had dedicated my whole life to just making ant videos, just for the purpose of being more rich <laughs> and making a bigger splash on YouTube, I feel like I will have wasted my years. Like, I'm looking around at this palenque here and, and the views here in Baguio, right? And these are all memories. Like, just putting my arm here on this pole. It's a memory. Basking in the sunlight here in the Philippine mountains. That's a memory. Do I want the majority of my life's memories to be sitting in front of a computer screen, editing and shooting ant stories? I, as much as I, I would love to do that, again, I feel like I would be wasting some of my other talents and not making enough memories for myself on, in this world. My boy squad, we have friends. Hey, you're asking me for a picture and I can't put you in my vlog? <laughs> yes, yes. What's your name? Anong Hi, pangalan mo? Chara. Chara. Alright, because we're Filipino, we're taking pictures. Yeah, of course. Alright, thank you. Thank you. Awesome. These guys are urban planners, guys. What you do yeah, is very I, I important. Video with Pangasinan. You, you did? To... There, RJ. There's uh -huh. RJ. He's from Pangasinan. What's your name? I'm Romeo. Your name's Romeo? Uh, yes. That's RJ's name. <laughs> Thank you. Is everything related to RJ here? <laughs> Mommy, are you buying Wallis? Yeah, here. Oh, to, to take back to Toronto? Yeah. Hmm. Nice. I don't have my Wallis anymore. That's amazing. Kuya, what is this made of? Tiger grass. Tiger grass. Wow, guys, this is made from tiger grass. I never knew that. I always grew up with my mom and my aunt and my grandma using the Filipino broom, the walis, and I never knew what it was made of. So it's made of tiger grass. Interesting. So it's grown on a farm or so wild? Farm. Farm, okay, wow. Is this that beetle nut? Yes. Oh wow, my boy squad. Remember Palau? Remember when we went to Palau and we got to chew the beetle nut? It's kind of like, I guess, their version of tobacco, sort of. Here's the Filipino version of it. Up here. Oh, it's called nganga. You just literally chew it. You chew it, right? And then you spit it out. Wow, interesting. It's like a nut from a tree. Beetle nut, they call it in Palau. Okay, Mabu High Squad, as is our tradition here on the channel, we need to buy ref magnets, fridge magnets. See? Let's get this one. I love Baguio, Philippines. Going on our fridge. Mommy, what's more important, money or memories? Memories. Yeah. For me, it's memories. Memories than money. It's priceless. Raquel and Jaya, mm hmm, beautiful ladies, and they're eating strawberries. What did you say? Only in Baguio? 20 pesos for this much. 20 pesos? Yeah. That's cheap. Yeah, that's very cheap. Is that, how much is that in US? Like a dollar or something, maybe less. Wow. It's like 50 cents for all of these strawberries. Wow. Ate LC. <laughs> yes. Guys, this is Ate LC if you're new to the channel. She's my awesome helper. And I call her my house manager because she does so much for me. Without her, I swear, I don't know what I would do in life. Let's make a new memory, Mabu High Squad, and eat these strawberries that are falling on the floor. Mmm. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Oh. We should we we should wash this. Oh, I'm eating horse poo poo. Got some tasty horse poo poo. For those of you who are new to this channel. Kuya Ryan, the best driver in the world. Yes, find yeah. me if you go going here. Yes, if you come to the Philippines, find him. How can they find you? I'll leave a link in the description for how you can contact yes. him. 
Yeah, they're they're a driving service. They're they're amazing, amazing. He's the best driver in the world. Mabuhay squad, look at how awesome the support is for the Ants Canada channel. It went up a hundred, over a hundred thousand subscribers in the past 28 days. It's just amazing. These games are crazy, seeking temporary love and fully rushing for the next one. But that game misses the wicked power you can find in passion when it's savored with the right one. When I say I want it intimate, I mean that I really get into it. Take my time and treat you like a goddess. Cause my boy squad, food, food, and more food. We're here at Vikings. Of course, the best buffet ever. And of course, the Golden Girls are eating. Yes. <laughs> so, I guess this is where I say bye, because I'm going to be making memories with my friends and family here at dinner at Vikings. Thank you, Raquel. Thank you for joining us for these Baguio vlogs. Stay tuned tomorrow for our next adventure. Golden Girls, say bye. 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 <laughs> The Golden Girls! Wow, they're playing Manila for you guys. 